We've made our way to the kitchen. I'm sandwiched in between two of our favorites. We have Miss Olivia and we have Scotty Mayfield. Scotty's going to talk in a little bit more, uh, a different segment about some of their new flavors, but he's joining us because he has the perfect topping to your is it brownie is it chocolate cake what are you calling it this is just chocolate cake okay. you can use any chocolate cake you want this is the chocolate sauce that we're making to go over the cake or mr mayfield's ice cream okay. or whatever you want to put it <laughs> over perfect i do want to tell everybody that my cookbook is here yay we've been waiting yeah. on this we've talked about it and we have plenty Good. Where do you find it? Just at the, the restaurant? Yes. Okay. Wonderful. I melted a third cup of sugar in a third cup of water, and then I added milk, and we have it to the simmer, and we're going to add two cups of semi-sweet chocolate chips. Does it matter what kind of milk? It should be whole milk? <laughs> Whole milk. Whole milk. Okay. I would now. You can use whatever you want to. I am not the milk police. Okay. But if you're going to eat chocolate sauce and you're going to eat cake and ice cream, put milk in it. The good stuff. <laughs> or half and half. Oh, even better. Yum. <laughs> anyway, after we get this nice and smooth, we will offer it over the cake and over the ice cream. Oh, that's wonderful. It looks delicious. And you've picked a, a Well, ice since cream. it was chocolate, I thought we would do Smoky Mountain Fudge, which which is chocolate ice cream and it's got a chocolate uh, syrup and this I mean a, a ripple and then it's got a, a um, fudge pieces in it. So it's it's Three chocolates. Can't have too many chocolates no, at don't all. Think so. I love it. Now he's the vanilla guy, though. Uh, you always tell us that's your favorite. Miss O, tell us more about the, the cookbook. Where did you gather all the recipes? Just over the years? That's a beginning. Okay. I already have a sequel started. Oh, okay. Yes. There's 200 plus recipes in there. They have most all been on Channel 10 and or in my newspaper column and or served at the restaurant. Awesome. And you can certainly get one of those at the restaurant. Yes, just, yes. You have them on a display area, just come in and ask for them. I do. And if you are too far away to come and get one, I have found that the postage and the container to send it in the envelope uh, is about $4.58 okay. plus the $15. So it scares $20 to death. Yeah. <laughs> Good. <laughs> That All smells right. real good. I know, it smells wonderful. So you just <laughs> layer it over the cake? Uh, yes. Okay. We don't have a little plate, and I'm not going to pour it over the whole thing. So folks will just have to find them something to put it on, and yes. then we'll dollop some chocolate over it. Chocolate, a little bit of ice cream. Delicious. Look at that. Oh, look at Saving the day. Okay. So we just put a little chocolate sauce on top. Yes. Now let's see how much of this I can spill through the hole in that spoon. Yeah. Mm, that's pretty good. It's not even making a mess. I'm not through yet. Okay. My mouth is just watering. I mean, like it crazy. looks amazing. Chocolate cake, chocolate sauce, and then some Smoky Mountain Fudge ice cream. And there was some good vanilla flavoring in the oh. milk, lest I lose the little teaspoon. Yum. Okay. Delicious. Well, Miss, oh, thank you so much. Thank Congrats you. on the cookbook. Again, you can find it at Miss Olivia's table. Remind us where you're located. 1108 West Broadway in the city of Maryville, about two blocks down the street from Maryville High School in the Oak Park Historic District. Awesome. Charming place, too. And this guy, meanwhile, is coming up a little bit later to share more of the ice cream flavors you can enjoy this summer.